Well, good morning, my friends. Good morning, my brothers and sisters. I wanted to tell you that I, re I came to realize this morning that that I need to stay obedient and the Lord and Jesus because they saved me. I'm slave to them and my I can't actually describe what I feel and what I understand, but what I came to understood, understand is that he saved me and I need to be grateful to him and stay obedient. In any case of my life where I will be tempted and my flesh will want to desire anything or want to, want to do anything what is not in the will of God will lead me to path where I will not understand what I need to do and I will be led away from that from the holy path. And so I just wanted to tell you my friends, don't 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 think that when you break down and cry that he doesn't listen to you. He really he really listens to you and he really cares about what you want to say to him and what your heart feels about other things what is worrying you so whenever you feel you whenever you feel that you don't know what to do and you feel weak and your flesh is taking over your spirit and your spirit can't fight back to it just let to God to deal with that let him to come in in your heart and deal with that. And he will help you. Trust me, he will help you. He helped me. Every month, month, I need to humble myself till the zero. Or every day. And actually, these couple of two weeks, I let my pride take over. The desires of my flesh was taking me over. And it was so horrible. I couldn't stand. And this morning, I broke down. And it was, it was just, just, it was horrible. So now I'm entering back home to Granny and hopefully everything will go smooth. I will read Bible, feed her. See, see you later. See you soon. <laughs> see you later. Bye, guys.